What's up YouTubers? In this video, I will be showing you how to create a folder in your airport time capsule. With this folder, you'll be able to drag and drop individual files uh, from either external hard drives or memory sticks or scan disks, and then uh, save them without having to access any memory off of your Mac device. Just remember, if you guys enjoy this video, if it feels at all helpful to you, please give it a thumbs up. It'll help my video get out there and help other people with airport time capsules, all right? The process to doing this is relatively straightforward. I will guide you step by step. If you head over to your finder, open this, go down to your shared items and access your time capsule. Within your time capsule menu, there'll be a data folder. If you open that up, now you are inside your time capsules hard drive. Here you can two finger tap to create a new folder and from here you can label it whatever you like give it a second to update and there you go now you've got a folder that you can drag and drop copy and paste items in and out of without having to access any of the memory on your Mac there you go guys, now you have a folder inside the hard drive of your airport time capsule. If you are wanting to take an external hard drive or a memory stick or a scan disk and put it directly into your time capsule without accessing any of the memory that goes into your Mac, I have a video that shows you exactly how to do that. It's in my how to section, I'll have a link in the description below. Thanks so much for watching guys, I hope this was a real help. Enjoy your Macs, enjoy your airport time capsules and I will see you later. Peace.